all month long we have been celebrating Black History Month. And this morning it's all about the Divine Nine, the historic black fraternities and sororities. And those are just some of our own ABC oh, wow. family members that you see who are part of the Divine That is quite a crew right now. Yeah. We have a performance coming up by students from Howard University. They're going to show us the Unity Step. It's a hallmark of the Divine Nine. But first, DeMarco Morgan, who's a Kappa from Jackson State, shares more on history. For more than a century, Black Greek letter organizations have been a rooted source of pride on college campuses. What is a Delta? What is a Delta? A power echoed in our chants and felt in our steps. Founded at a time when racism and discrimination plagued higher education. The four sororities and five fraternities that make up the National Panhellenic Council, also dubbed the Divine Nine, unite under a collective purpose, scholarship, service, and the power of community. They understood that their individual, you know, education was not enough. They had to actually work as a group to lift up people. The Divine Nine kind of encompasses that whole ethos. When we set our mind to something, oh, we're going to get that something done. And from the corner office to the box office, the football field to the hill, Divine Nine members have been doing just that, all while standing on the front lines of change and the corridors of power. We are in different areas of the business. We understand if we come together collectively, we have an obligation to serve the community and most importantly, um, serve Black people. Um, and so uh, we understand that when Black people wins, America wins. My own journey to Kappa started back in 2000 on the campus of Jackson State University. There, I was uplifted and taught the true meaning of achievement in every field of human endeavor. These lifelong commitments are a reflection of the day-to-day -day work these organizations carry out throughout college campuses and communities worldwide. And our thanks to DeMarco. And if you notice, I'm wearing pink and green this morning because these are the colors of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, the sorority my dear mom pledged at Howard University. And I was blessed to recently become an honorary AKA. And that's mama there on the there campus at, at HU. There she is. Mm -hmm. And we are joined now by students from your mom's alma mater, uh, the Divine Nine, the university's Divine Nine. Thank you all so much Thank for you. being here, for, for sharing with us the steps you will. I want to start asking you, Naya, uh, you're the Divine Nine, such a presence on campuses. What has it been like to be a part of a sorority? How big is that a part of your college experience? Yes, so sisterhood has obviously been something that I've gained, but I've also loved being able to serve in a capacity with things like this. I really love the arts and being able to give back to the community in ways that I was able to receive things from a young age and to be able to receive mentorship from my big sisters. That's something that I really value in this life and being in my sorority. Isn't it great to have that immediate family? Yes. I just love yeah. that experience. Can I get a ski wee? Can I get a ski wee? <laughs> <laughs> it's like looking at my mom and my dad, because my dad was a Q-Dog yeah. at Howard University, yes, yeah. as are you. And it is about this every generation mm -hmm. and the tradition and, yeah. and your legacy, too. Yes, you know? what, does that, what does that mean to you? It means everything to me. So, you know, my family's legacy in this fraternity started with my dad on the campus of North Carolina A&T mm -hmm. in 1989. Uh, this past spring, I was initiated at Howard University, uh, as well as my brother. He was actually initiated in uh, Ham uh, on Hampton's campus mm -hmm. this past spring as well. So uh, long before we were all members of Omega Sci-Fi uh, Fraternity Incorporated, those two guys were my best friends, you know what I mean? So uh, now that we're all members of the greatest fraternity in the world, uh, our bond has somehow gotten even stronger. So uh, simply put, it means everything to me and it's something that I'll covet for the rest of my life. Truly a That's family right. affair, yeah, you cherish that. Yeah. Tell folks what they're about to see. So you all are about to witness a unity step. Usually we all in our specific organization step with our brothers and our sisters, but today we like to come together and showcase the Divine Nine and we're all gonna do a step together, but also showcase our individual style from our organizations as well. Isn't that wonderful? That's awesome. Okay, I mean, it's, it's standing room only here in the studio right now. You can't even see it. Because we've all been waiting all morning long for this unity step and you're about to see just how powerful it is, right? All right. Good bring job. it, bring it. Let's do it. Set. E P H C.
said only, only, I said only, only. Thank you so much because you all have a unique step, but you came together the unity of the divine nine. You look just like my mom. I mean, what do you do that? She, and, the, and, the, and daddy used to do that too. He even had the brand. Oh, yeah, and yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right. Unbelievable. It is. And, and, we, and we want to thank everybody from Howard University, everyone who participated all, so very all month long in our Black History Month coverage. And we want to take a look. Can we look at the mural one more time here in our yeah. studio? It's been there all month long. And we're happy to share that a portion of the painting's proceeds will go towards charity. And you can find out more about the artist Georgie Nakima on her Instagram at Garden of Germany. Oh, uh, Garden of uh, Journey. Thank did I you. say that right? Yeah. You did. Okay. You got it. Great. You got it. Guys, thank you all thank you. so very much. Thank you. Thank you. It's thank been you a all. true pleasure. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.